about this Bacao that everybody is talking about? Mm. I'm glad that everybody's talking about it. <laughs> 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 At least we had a and a traction. Uh, but probably not everyone in the art trade, but in the uh, art trade section of the, uh, the industry, or yeah. the art. Because you don't have a lot of product, you don't have a lot of product. No, I don't have a lot of product. I don't have a lot of product. Anyway, what is the product? Well, initially it was thought to be, in other words, hindi ganun ka-fix na. So we thought of coming up with an art event that is committed primarily to the kind of raising awareness about the environmental issues. But eventually, siguro, along with that, medyo nag-emerge din yun with equal importance you need to raise the level of unity among artists ganun it came out of the assessment that I think yung Kumbaga parang medyo nag-diminish yung role ng artist in terms of yung artist awareness of themselves. Ibig sabihin, uh, for most part, um, artists have allowed themselves to be instruments of a bigger entity. No? Yung kanyari mga, ano, mga corporate business corporations yung ganun, and their uh, interest. So, uh, in other words, marami sa art practice uh, is not really all about uh, the artist's um, connection with a, a community, but more of a connection to a uh, business uh, organization. Yung ganun. Yeah. So, parang naging ganun yung ano niya, kadalasan, and the way we see it, it's not really uh, healthy for the yeah. artist. You're talking about galleries? No, no, not just galleries. Actually, I mean, we're talking about a wide range of, the, the whole range of uh, art practice. It means that it's not visual arts, uh, music, theater, and all that. So, parang tipo, uh, because of the privacy of yung, ano, yung livelihood and commercial uh, pursuits, ganun, and tendency is the artist uh, tend to uh, work towards one's ano, yung self gratification. Hyping up the hyping up the ego, the the name. Oh, again, ano? Ah, yung mga ano classic. Parang brand. Every name is a brand. Yeah. So, parang ah, but we haven't really. I wouldn't say we have really figured out figured out as a group, no. Kung ah, how to deal with that, and I would even say we haven't really as a group ah arrived at a you know ah. Unified position, not yet. But I think, in tacit terms, there's already that kind of, you know, parang inclination towards that. So, sa ngayon kasi medyo hindi pa ganon kaliwana ng salahat o sa bawat isa. So, as you as as the concept develop, na wala yung na wala yung environmental aspect. No, no, not really. In fact, it's still there, and yung parin yung parang I would say unifying theme ah sa lahat ng mga works nila. Mainly because we we still acknowledge that it is an urgent issue. Yung ganon. And, but we see it now as a consequence of a, uh, ano, parang, uh, yung kumbaga, the 
consequence of the actions of a bigger ano yung entity kunyari yung, yung mga malaking corporation sila pa rin naman mainly yan eh. it's the culture they created so sabihin natin uh, kunyari sabi nga ni Joy ayala hindi lang naman yung mga malalaking public ay mga maliliit na tao and tulad natin but then yung mga maliliit na tao parang uh, produkto din ng kultura na nilikha ng mga malalaking negosyo. Yes. So they created a culture that uh, sustains uh, and encourages uh, ano, parang uh, eh, parang yeah, yeah. Parang kumbaga uncritical consumption. Mm -hmm. eh, bili lang ng bili kahit hindi na kailangan. Ganun. So, mal malaking ano yun. Uh, so, so we, we see that as so integral to each other. No? So, kaya yung, yung environmental issue at saka yung kumbaga yung prevailing culture. Not just among artists but in society. Yung ganun. Masyadong magkadikit yun eh. Yeah. connected siya with the concept of the commons, mm -hmm. which has been extended. Na, dati kasi yung commons, ano lang siya eh. It's an amic concept lang siya, sa economics lang. Mm -hmm. Later on, naging magkaroon ng cultural commons, mm -hmm. lalo na yung mga wala ng copyright, if you share yung artwork, may hapit. Um, so, we keep it yan yung bawa, may common authorship of an article. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, so, wala na yung individual, wala na yung ego, wala na yung name as a brand. Uh, so, yung environmentalism, tsaka yung, yung sinasabi mo na wawala yung self dun sa community. Magka, magka, ano yan, magkasama yan. Eh. Yeah. Uh, yun ba yung... That's, that's the part of what we hope uh, will come out, no? But it's not something that is not yet evident sa maraming mga... I mean, even with those who are involved in this project. Uh -huh. um, <laughs> I mean, in terms of our behavior, basically, hindi naman natin ganun ka daling i... Ay, yung ganun, i-explicate sarili natin sa ganyan. Masyadong, so, it's so deeply embedded in our consciousness na yung behavior natin sometimes belay our uh, words, di ba? So, uh, but at least the thing is, we're trying to do something. Uh, may mga ganong inisyatiba na sinisimulan natin. So, hopefully, uh, it's not on the application. Well, can you set an example of how, how the Bacawan concept is manifested in sa mga nagawa niya? Well, siguro one of the things I uh, am fond of citing is the one in the uh, stand farm. Um, mm, yung, ano, para kumbaga, th this is a spot kasi that is seldomly seen by people. You have to go out of your way para makita mo. And, uh, at saka yung mga makakakita man, if ever, mostly would be people from the uh, so-called informal settler communities of UP. Yung ganun. So, kumbaga, um, this is not kind of ano, parang catering to the uh, yung tawag ito, yung mga medyo upscale na audience in UP. Yung ganun. So that's one already, no? So yung mga artists na pumunta doon, they still decide to do their work. And then on top of that, there's also a commitment to be immersed in the community. Um, admirable yung mga artists na nag-commit doon dahil unang-una, uh, sobrang challenging yung lugar eh. 
Ang dumi-dumi, napaka-alikabok, ang daming mga insects na hindi mo makita kakagat ka. So, um, kung sanay na sanay ka sa komportabling buhay, talagang it's the place na ayaw mo talagang punta ka. Pangalawa, kung sanay na sanay ka sa attention ng, ano, yung, uh, ng uh, audience sa art, that's again not the place you would want to do your art. Dahil malayo masyado, hindi siya pakikita kagad. Yung ganun. So, um, but the place was transformed. Parang ano din siya. Parang din siyang uh, exposure trip para yeah. sa city boys. City boys and girls. <laughs> so, yeah, but it's actually a part of the city that most, uh, kumbaga, if you come from a uh, middle, upper middle class, comfortable background, but hindi mo talaga iniisip kung tao niya. And I think it was transformative, transformative to everyone who was involved in that project. Kasi, uh, well, the place was transformed, even the community was transformed, yung ganang, uh, the artists were, uh, I would say, they were transformed by it. Uh, uh, yeah, I think that, um, and in essence, that's what it really is all about sa tingin ko dahil, uh, ano, yung, it's the artist reconnecting with the community. So para siyang yung social sculptures ni, social sculptures ni Joseph Boyce. Parang yung mga ginagawa ni na Alan Riyamil yun na mga... Pwede, except in this process, it's not so much about the artist themselves, by themselves alone. Um, the artist sa tingin ko, in some of the works there, uh, yung participation ng community, direct participation of the community is evident. Yun ganun. And I think that's very important because uh, your ownership uh, is very important in this case. No? And uh, for this new song, sila, this was uh, Chits and Aileen's idea. Uh, Chits uh, Ramirez and Stasi Aileen's idea. This was really their idea. So, talagang, uh, the community felt that they own oh, okay. the project. That's why they're also keen on protecting it or parang sustaining it. So, uh, I don't know. It sounds very ideal. No, uh, I, I don't know how long that can be sustained. But, um, yeah, like I said, parang ganun yung gusto ko talagang makita kasi it's, it's really all about trying yung yung kumbaga alam yung church context uh, the artist is the one who creates the liturgy yung ganun so liturgical yung uh, role ng artist in that context by trying to recreate uh, the sacred in that community conceptualizing Bacawan by myself. Kumbaga, ano din to, result din to ng mga um, unang-una yung mga discussions uh, with uh, people na pareho yung inclination. 
and then parang build up the, through the years of doing uh, parang art initiatives in the past. So, um, so sa tingin ko, I think that should be the case dahil it's hard to dictate at the onset ang may dapat mangyari. Uh, I think the beauty of this thing is as you go, uh, it's a surface yung mga iba't ibang uh, bagay na nakakapag-enrich ng uh, ganitong venture. And then you also discover uh, ano yung mga parang dapat iwasan. Mga, uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, siguro uh, there was an incident na nakapag uh, antagonize kami ng mga skate parties. I don't know if you were if you're aware of that. No. So, parang part of our uh, one of the components of the festival, uh, parang was to paint over uh, a mural on one of the walls outside the uh -huh. uh, campus. Uh, we secured the necessary, you know, parang permission or the requirements, But I think one of the things we overlooked was there's a, uh, ano, parang a street art culture, mm -hmm. na hindi masyadong familiar sa part. I mean, as you know, parang medyo, I think it's a class so, thing. So, it's like the territory of GAM? Oh, yeah, parang like that. Oh. So, mm -hmm. parang kumbaga, medyo pagka, if you come from a medyo comfortable background, then you become a connected sa, no. Parang it's something that you take for granted, na parang, okay, we got the permit already, that's all that's necessary. But you sort of uh, forget uh, the part na, uh, may mga taong gumawa dyan earlier, so at least they should be considered in Vietnam. And I think it's kind of risky uh, to just simply uh, paint over somebody's work. Uh, and then, ang, ang consequence, I mean, especially if it's dealing with the same concern. No? So parang tipong, uh, ang magiging consequence niya, nagsisimula ka pa lang, um, magkakaroon ka na kagad ng kaaway, hindi maganda yun. So we, ano, parang uh, we patched up that issue immediately. Oh. Parang nakipagayusan ka ng sa mga tao. Uh, and uh, very amiable naman yung mga comments na uh, in, parang uh, they understood the situation and uh, like uh, um, And I think that's one of the things, no, parang uh, so you work with different kinds of people in this, uh, in this project. So may mga tao na iba't iba yung personalities nila. Hindi na proses, hindi na proses. So that's one of the dynamics that you really have to deal with. Yung iba medyo strong, yung iba medyo consistent sa mga ganito and they won't have it any other way. Um, and some in, well, that was one of the reasons na we, we don't have a painting exhibit. Kasi painting is parang in this case, medyo parang in spirit na festival is medyo pasay na yung painting. So parang it was kind of dismissed. Uh, sale <laughs> uh, but I think the irony is yung this project actually uh, got most of its uh, funding from paintings from the sales yeah. of paintings yeah. so uh, siguro including yours sorry including your, your yeah paintings. mostly um, <laughs> which uh, gave you a, a piece sum uh, in the bank mm -hmm. and you were able to to uh, finance this project. Yeah, but of course we were able to get some from NCCA. But it's substantial, but it's not, uh, does not uh, comprise the law from the So, yung, 
di ba part din naman yun ng Bacawa? Kasi ang Bacawa, uh, as you said, it was an experiment in community building. Yeah. So, parang part siya ng evolution ng community building, yung conflicts within uh, kasi community naman is still effective of individuals. So, andan yung struggle ng... Mm, that, that, that's a safety event, talaga. Uh, nakaka... Siguro, it's just one of those things that really strain you. Dahil, syempre, uh, pero pa rin, you also have your limitations. Tao pa rin din, eh, di ba? Parang mga ganyan, medyo apektado pa rin. Uh, Pagka gano'n. But, I guess this is really one of those instances where your ego can, uh, can't get in the way. Otherwise, talagang babagsak yung ano eh. Kasi parang, uh, ang, ang key kasi is to maintain uh, a working chemistry right. with uh, everyone in the team. So, Bakawan, as, as a name, although, ang um, nire-refer niya mangrove, yung bayon na yung So, it's also Bakawan village. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Bakawan barrio. Yeah. It's really more of the ecosystem. Uh -huh. Kasi parang the ecosystem built around the Bakawan. So, kumbaga, yan, parang complete. Including uh, human species, <laughs> unfortunately. <laughs> uh, uh, which actually would be a good uh, focal point because the bottom line actually is uh, creating self-awareness. by itself, it's an ideal ecosystem. No? Uh, pag nandiyan yung tao, yung tao lagi mag-disrupt ng balance. Yun so parang, how do you uh, analyze yourself in relation to that context? And in relation to your desire to you know, prolong your existence on this uh, planet, di ba? Yung ganyan klase mo sa pen. At unless gusto mo nang sagarin, mamatay ka na, malaking lao na lahat ng tao, di, it's also fine. Hindi ba? Kasi sa Australia, yung Gaia movement na tinatawag ka na. Tinatakwi nila yung primacy ng human species. Sabi nila, yung ecosystem is everything within it. Lahat ng insects, lahat yan. And hindi dapat anthropocentric yung tao na everything should work for the human. Yeah, right. So, well, I, I totally agree with that. Because nature uh, is in perfect harmony until the humans came. <laughs> uh, and of course, yung mga tao, they have to create uh, an ideology that uh, justifies their primacy, that uh, everything is uh, built for them. So, mga boy, ginawa ng Diyos para sa barbecue ng tao. Yun yung gano'n. Pero, yun na nga eh. Kaya nga, I don't know if everybody in the team agrees with my complete assessment that it's really capitalism. It's behind all this para progressive degradation of our work. It's not, it's not just about the environment, the mundo natin. And it's the kind of culture that it has created. It really values our humanity. Curious about, is everyone involved in the group aware of your vision?